The inaugurated substations are the 400 kV Kunene substation and Omatangu station, as well as the 190 km interconnector overhead transmission line. The substations are a mere 30 km south of the Angola Namibia border at the Ruakana power station and the Omatando substation in Ongwadiva that are seamlessly connected by an overhead transmission line. Elwindo says the two substations and transmission line are vital highways that will bring electricity to every part of the country. Critically, this infrastructure provides uh, a blueprint for our energy future. Well designed, transmission lines and substations provide the foundation to a fully electrified and prosperous Namibia. As you all know, uh, that is our goal for Vision 2030, where we have got a prosperous Namibia. The substations are not mere steel and cables, but the embodiment of Namibia's commitment to energy security. The infrastructure improvements are a huge part of the country's answer to the call for a more resilient and sustainable energy future. They allow Namibia to tap into the boundless power of the sun today and for generations to come. The substations symbolize the power of regional integration and the Secretary of State for Water Affairs in Angola, Manuel Quintino, was happy to witness the completion of the project. The substation is an important infrastructure, not only for Namibia but also for Angola. Uh, regarding Angola, it will enable the transmission of power transmission of electricity to, to, to southern region. Uh, I would say a line, a power line which will pass uh, Changongo and uh, Kaama and interlink uh, to, to, to the national grid of Angola. NAMPOWER's Managing Director Kahenge Haulufu says the provision of reliable, secure electricity is a duty they are committed to fulfill as part of their national development plans. In addition, true to our ambition, the main to maintain the national transmission grid at world-class standards, NAMPOWER installed a 400 kV air core higher voltage shunt reactors at the Kunene substation. These are some of the first. We will see them later when we go in there, those who will get the opportunity. We are also in the process of installing this at ours, at Kokerboom, at Jerez, and the Obib substations across the country. These are the first ever 400 kV air core reactors to be installed in Africa is second only to Germany uh, in the world.